What a delicious lunch we're having. I didn't think we'd just sit here and eat, hmm? Can we get some more? Sure we can. Let's go to the store and see if there's anything tasty we can buy. Sure, let's go. What do you want to buy? I was thinking of buying snacks. And I wanted something sweet because we haven't had anything sweet lately. And I wanted something sweet because we haven't had anything sweet lately. Hmm, maybe yes. Let's see what's available and decide what we can buy on the spot because we don't have a lot of money. Wow, look at this, JJ. There's so much fruit. I love this fruit. It's delicious and sweet. Uh, there's some pies here. I think we could get some of those. Come on, let's go. I don't think we can buy anything. I didn't bring any money. Look, it's that salesman. Is he back in town? Let's go to him and ask him what he's doing here. Guys, follow me. I want to show you the merchandise I got. I think you're going to like it. Sounds very interesting, man. Of course we want to see what you brought here. This must be a very interesting thing, because I can see it from here. Let's get closer. I can't see very well from far away. Guys, for $64, you'll get a place where some unknown Monument stands. You'll be the first to buy it, because nobody wants to buy it yet, but you better hurry up. JJ, what are we waiting for? Let's go earn money to buy a map of where this monument is. I'm so curious about this place. I'm so used to this place. Let's take our pickaxes and start mining ore to buy the monument map he's selling. <laughs> 75 years later. Now that we've mined so much ore, let's go to that vendor and buy a map of that monument before someone else does it faster than us. <laughs> hey man, we came back with a bunch of emeralds. We wanted to buy a map of the monument. Give it to me. I'll take a look. Hmm, I can't price them, guys. I'm sorry, but I told you they are worth $64, not emerald. So you need to sell this ore first, and then you can come back to me with no cash. And where can we sell it? What a strange seller. These emeralds are so clean. Hmm? JJ, look over there. It says exchanger. I think we can sell our emeralds there and get our money. Hey, man. We came in with a bunch of clean emeralds and we'd like to get paid for them. You can do that, right? That's great. Thank you so much. You're helping us out. Oh, thank you so much. Now we can spend that money where we need it. Good luck, man. Let's hurry up, Mikey, before that salesman sells that monument card to somebody else. Hey, we're back with cash, just like you asked. Here's your money. Great job, guys. Nice to do business with you. The map of the monument is in that ruined castle over there. Go there and you will find what you are looking for. Oh. All right. So this map is around here somewhere. Let's look inside the chests. They're closed. Did he trick us? How are we supposed to open these chests? He didn't even give us a key to open them. What are we going to do, JJ? Huh? Look over there. Is that the key we need? I don't know. Let's get him and see if he'll open the chest. Mm hmm. Hmm. Maybe he'll open two chests. I'll have to check. Ha! He opened them both. That's just great. Hey, hey. There were two drills in those chests. I don't know why we need them, but I think we're going to need them. So what's up, Mikey? Let's go find that monument. I think it should be that way, based on the clues that are in here. Hmm. To get up there, we need a ladder, right? Here are the ladders. I found them in one of the chests. Let's hurry up and go up the mountain. Mikey, you did a great job taking them with you. Now we can easily climb the mountain. Let's go up and find that monument. A few moments later. Phew, I thought we'd never get up here. But there's still so much to climb. So Mikey, let's not waste any time and get up there quick. Mm -hmm. If we continue at this pace, we'll be at the top of this mountain in a couple hours. Let's go. Mikey, aren't you tired? Let's hang on till we get to the top of the mountain. Then we can rest. Mikey, be careful you don't accidentally fall. It'll be very bad if we fall. Don't worry, JJ. I won't fall unless there's a bunch of candy underneath. I hope we can get up the mountain very quickly. Mm -hmm. Two hours later. We're almost to the top of the mountain. Soon we'll be able to rest. Mm -hmm. Oh, JJ, look over there. That's the monument the salesman told us about. I think we find it. Let's go over there and see what's so interesting. Yep. It's so beautiful here, but it's also very dangerous, huh? JJ, look over there. What are they doing there? Who are they? I don't know, but let's get closer and see what they're doing. Uh-huh. JJ, I'm so scared to look at them in case they do something. They look so dangerous. Do you think they won't see us? No, I don't think so. If we're quiet, they shouldn't notice us. Let's quietly get closer, and maybe we'll see what they're doing. Let's walk past very quietly then. Are they doing some kind of ritual? What do you think they want, and why they're doing it? 
I don't know what this Ryudal is or if it's dangerous, but let's try to find out. Let's just watch them for now. <laughs> JJ, when are they gonna finish their ritual? I feel like we've been standing here watching them for over an hour. Mm hmm. Huh? Huh? Mikey, I think they've spotted us. Come on, run! Don't get caught. We don't know what they'll do to us. <laughs> I'm so scared of the way they look at us. I can't look at them. They're so scary. <sighs> JJ, they're all around us. What are we gonna do? I don't know. What do you want? What are you doing here? Leave us alone, please. Leave us alone. I don't want to go in that water. No! <laughs> oh! Yeah. A few moments later. Hmm. What was that now? Mikey, is that you, Mikey? What happened to you? What happened to me? Did you see yourself? What happened to you? Who are you? You're seeing all this too, aren't you? I'm not imagining it, am I? <laughs> Level 1 death gun blood? What does that mean? I don't understand what's going on here. Whoa! Sheesh! Is that we're like death now? But why us and what do we have to do? These death sides, they can kill a man. But why do we have to do all this? I don't get it at all. I don't get it either, huh? Come here, JJ, it's something written here else. It says, mission one, kill all the villagers. Do we really have to do that? I guess we have no choice. You hear that big man's voice too, don't you? I hear him too. I think we're gonna have to do it, JJ. Two hours later. So let's go to the village in case he does something to us. Well, then we'll have to go and do what he asks. So villagers beware of us. Then let's kill them real quick. So they'll feel sorry for us. And maybe they'll let us go. Let's kill as many people as we can. What's up, guys? You're gonna die for us today. You can't see us, but you're gonna die today. Yes, you'll die for the greater good. So we can upgrade or become human again. But why am I telling you this? You'll die quickly anyway. Upgrade? You mean get better at dying? What if we stay like this forever? We have to kill them all, and we have no other choice. We need to kill as many inhabitants as we can. I think we're doing a great job. Look how good our weapons are. They die like cockroaches. If we think we'll get weapon upgrades, then it'll be easy to kill. So we're helping Death now. So we're his employees now. But why us? I think we need to find out or ask someone close to him. Even though we've killed so many villagers, why are there still so many? I didn't know we had so many. I always thought we had so few. I never thought there were so many of them. Maybe because we hardly ever come to the village. They go out in the morning to work and then rest and just stay at home in the evening. Maybe. But then where are the rest of them? We killed them all. The rest of them must have run away somewhere. I'd do the same thing if I were them. You guys can't run from death, much less two. So you better get ready for a quick death. They can thank you for a quick death. Now that we're done, who's supposed to check it all out? Hey guys, great job. I didn't think you could do it so fast. Now you can follow me. I'll show you where the next challenge awaits. Follow me. All right, let's hurry up, Mikey. <laughs> and where are we going, Harbinger of Death? Or what should I call you? Huh? Uh -huh. Guys, hurry up here. Now the second challenge awaits you. You have to kill all the inhabitants of this village now. You get a weapon upgrade. Now you are a little bit stronger. You can start the task. All right. So now we're stronger and we can kill them faster and we have to kill the villagers. Mm -hmm. Is this some kind of military village? Do they see us? Do they want to attack us? Are they serious? Do they want to fight death? This is your grave mistake. We will kill you very quickly. Ha ha, that was easy. Now all we have to do is kill the rest of the villagers. What's up, guys? Watch out for us. We're very bloodthirsty now. Yeah, you can't run away from us now because we've gained some experience. You've gained some experience for us. Don't worry about us. Think about yourself because we'll kill you quickly and easily. So you'd better be grateful. Ha ha, that was easy. Now all we have to do is kill the rest of the villagers. What's up, guys? Watch out for us. We're very bloodthirsty now. You didn't think that if you clamped down on me from several sides, you could kill me? No, of course not. You're too weak for us. Now we're level two death. It's taking so long to kill you all. There's so many of you and only two of us. That's okay, we have no choice but to kill you. So we have to hurry up and get out of here, Mikey. Mm -hmm. JJ, look at the crowd of villagers. There's a whole bunch of them. Let's run in there and kill them all. I think they think they can get away from us, but they can't. Now that we've almost killed them all, there's only a few inhabitants left to kill, right? Now we have to find them. It's going to take a long time. I don't think there's any JJ's. Look, 
There's a bunch more of them! I don't think there's very few of them left! There's a lot more of them! So let's not get complacent! Alright! Now, we only have a couple of lives left to kill. So we only have a little work left to do. I wonder if we're going to keep pumping or if this is the end. Because I don't see us getting any stronger. We're already strong enough. I think we can get even stronger. These residents are a little stronger than the ones we killed before. So I think we can get even stronger. JJ, if we can't kill them, what happens to us? I don't know, but this village is finished. Where's that death proponent? He's supposed to come and check on our work. There he is, JJ. He's coming right at us. How do you think we did? I'm always looking out for you kids. You deserve a reward. That's why you get the upgraded death weapon. You can check it out right now. I'm sure you'll love it. Whoa. What do you think about that? What do we think? We love it. We're very strong now. I think we can easily do what needs to be done. 2,000 years later. Now that you are a little stronger, you can kill villages like this. People here are much stronger than normal. So be careful. Good luck to you. So what's up, Mikey? I think we can take them out with these weapons. It'll be another killing experience for us. Do you think we can get any more improvements? More improvements? I think so. But that would be too much. Especially these residents are not as simple as before. They are stronger and more resilient. Look! We don't kill them with one blow, so we have to work hard here. Even if we don't kill them in one hit, we still have it easy. We can blow their village to smithereens, flatten it to the ground, and not even a speck of dust. I see you've gotten a taste for JJ. It's very scary. You don't see it the way I see it, because I look at you and I see some scary monster that easily kills even the strongest inhabitants. And what's so convenient is that we can mix different weapons of death. I mean, first you blow them up, they'll do it. And while they're landing, I'll finish them off with a Star-Lord weapon. It's so convenient and so easy to do. I can't imagine what's next for us. I think we can just blow their village to smithereens. I think the next weapon will be much scarier than this one. I'm afraid to imagine what it does. It's creeping me out. You see how easy it was to blow up that building? It was so easy. They couldn't even repel that attack because it doesn't reflect. It's too easy. I think we can get through this place very quickly and easily. What do you want, villagers? You've got two deaths who want to raise. So if I were you, I'd just run like hell. We won't even know the difference if you're 100 or even 1,000. We'll kill you all because that's our mission. Look at this. You can't even do anything. It's too easy. You have no idea. And even we don't know what's next. The next weapon of death will wipe you off the face of the earth, most likely. That's it, guys. The rest of your villagers have dispersed to the village and are waiting for their time to die. It was easy. All we had to do was kill the remaining villagers. Don't be afraid. I'm sure you enjoyed it because it was a quick death. It's so good that you've already accepted your fate. You're not even fighting back. It's so good that you won't fight with us anymore. It makes our mission so much easier because I wouldn't want to kill you while you're trying to defeat us. Even though you won't succeed because you'll die instantly, it's not an ordinary death. It's instantaneous. It's the end for you. There's only a couple of you left, so they think this is the end of our mission. JJ, there's still a bunch of residents out there who are already afraid of you. I think that's a wake-up call that we should call it a day. You think so? I'm just getting the hang of it. It was so cool to be dead for so long. I hope the next mission will be as interesting or easy. I don't know what to call it. I guess you could call it insanity because you've gone too crazy, JJ. It's not true, Mikey. Ugh. Ugh. What happened? Where did we end up? Back at that monument. What's coming? Is this another test? I'm ready. Who do I have to kill? JJ, there's some kind of sign here. I think it's addressed to us. Your mission is over. Thank you for your service. What does that mean? Is that the end of it? What is being fired at? Ah! JJ, we're surrounded by those harbingers of death. They want to kill us. Then let them try to do it first. I won't let them do it. They're the presetters of death? They're too weak for them. If there were a thousand of them, maybe they'd have a chance. JJ, I think it's time for us to become human beings again. That sign is there for a reason. It's time for us to get rid of it. Ugh! Ugh. Mikey, it's you, it's me again. We're human again, aren't we? I can't believe what I turned into when I was death. It's so good to be human again. 
I think after such a hard day, we should go back home and get a good night's sleep because after such a hard day, we need rest. All right. A few moments later. Mikey, I can't believe this is actually happening. We're home again, and we can eat food like old times again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did you think we'd just let you go? You shouldn't think so. You're finished too. 